All right. Super well, good. sausage and sakarat Hungarian goulash. That's just two of the menu items you're going to find at today's edition. Tina Makua was in Sacramento with more on Sam's Hofbra. Take a look. I've been eating it for more than 52 years, and I keep coming back for the obvious reason. It has to be good. Sam's Hofbrau has been a staple of Sacramento since 1959. People come in for their favorites. The roast ham, the roast turkey were the, both the best for me. And today, I'm going with the turkey again. That's 52 years later. This eatery was opened by restaurateur Sam Gordon. It changed ownership a couple of times, but today it's back with Sam's family. Sam is, you know, a great eatery. The people come to have drinks at the bar and great food. You want to dip the au jus? So here's what you can expect. Just get in line and order when it's your turn. Sandwiches come a la carte. Um, you can have side dishes, and the entrees come with two sides. Sliced meat and a couple side dishes, whatever you like, hot or cold. Homemade potato salad, fresh turkey stuffing, green beans, whatever you like. Top three sandwiches that are hand carved right in front of you. Pastrami, number one. Turkey, close to number two. And roast beef, French dip sandwiches. Amazing. I'm a creature of habit. I always get the um, hot pastrami sandwiches. Always. Hey, you want mashed potatoes? Repeat customers, repeat orders. I love their turkey sandwiches. That's all I ever eat here is their turkey sandwiches. The atmosphere is great. And we have a, they don't rush you because we can sit here and talk, you know, and everything. Families are always welcomed here. In fact, generations have walked through the doors. My dad, me, and my son, and now four because my son's had a baby. So he's coming in too. So yeah, we've been coming in here for probably 40 years or more. I've tried everything and I love it. It's, it's the best, best food in town, it really is. <laughs> everybody here knows everybody. Um, it's like a family, right? You come here and everybody tells you what they did that day, or what they're gonna do that afternoon. So it's, it's pretty close. It's like a family, which is nice. Everybody needs that. Mm, that looked really good. Well, if you have a restaurant that you would like Tina to check out, send her an email at gooddaytina at kmaxtv.com. Celebrate the 120th Philippine Independence Day with a feast.